Interesting. Very interesting. All right, Kara. What's up with Kara? Rose's farm. Thanks for the eight months. How are you doing, Siva? Father of our human child. Hello. Oh, I'm looking for Rose. Talking. Is she here? What do you oh. want with her? I need oh, to talk to her. Someone. She doesn't want to talk. Go away. Who? Please, I really need to see her. I'm Rose. Who are these people? What can I do for you? I was told you could help us. Help you? It's better if we talk inside. Do you think we can trust him? You don't really have a choice. Don't have a choice. Yeah, there you go. Are you winning? We're trying our best, dude. Oh, we just keep messing up Marcus' timeline. <sighs> keep messing up Marcus' timeline, going in a way I don't want to go. Hello, family. What if we just take the house and this is our home? You okay? I'm cold, Kara. We'll get inside. You'll warm up in no time. I like our outfit. Our outfit upgrade has been cool. Look at her. Look at her. Maybe we have more friends. Maybe I think these people, these people over here. Come in. Be my friend? Be your so what's your name? Alice. She's running a fever. We've spent the last few nights outside. She's exhausted. There's a spare room upstairs. You can put her to bed and I'll bring her something to eat. Adam, will you show them upstairs? Oh, will you be our friends? Wait, what if we're all family? Wait, 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 wait. What if we are the one? Can we be siblings? Oh, what if we're a big family? Wait, what if you're my sister and then you're, you're our cousin? We gotta expand this family. All right, let's go upstairs. I need to play this game again. I handed in my ending. See, that's. I think I'm gonna have to. Re I, I will have to play it again. I'm. I'm. I feel like I'm gonna do this a lot. Oh. It's gonna be hard to like figure out how to do the different endings, though. You know, just do the exact opposite of what I do, I suppose. Brendos, what's up, Saga? Hi, Saga. Look, look, we have a home now. With our family, we chop wood and do th the cool stuff. We play Scrabble. No trench foot, no trench foot, no wet feet. We're gonna dry your clothes out, we're gonna put it by the fireplace, and you're gonna tuck y'all in. We can get you some new pajamas. There's, those clothes are probably damp. Get you a big old shirt. I'm fine, Kara. We can't stop because of me. We've got to get across the border. You need rest. Get a good night's sleep and we'll set off again tomorrow. Why do humans hate us? We didn't do anything wrong.
Maybe it's a misunderstanding. Maybe they just need time to understand what we really are. Why can't we just talk to each other? They'd see we're not bad. I don't know. I really don't know. I don't know what you like, but I made you Rose's world famous spaghetti. Spaghetti! You'll be back on your feet in no time. Spaghetti family There's recipe! Something for your Thank you. <laughs> Rose is Italian. This I'll get these washed and dried. Thank you. Ah, oh, family. family. I wish I had an Android sister, yeah. Just eating? I suggest you eat. Come on, you, you got to eat something. You haven't had anything since we left. Promise me you'll try? I'll be downstairs if you need anything. You must eat the spaghetti. You must eat the spaghetti. Get some sleep. And tomorrow, you'll be stronger than me. Look at this family. Rosie, what's up? Playing switchboards? Are you breaking a sweat? I'll stay with her a while. <laughs> What's up, Sue? Doing the same, doing the same. Rose is so cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Our family. I mean, our family is precious. Our, our family is precious. We need a grandpa. We need we need some grandparents. We gotta find some grandparents, and then we gotta find... Then we gotta find a little snot-nosed little kid for you to play with who, you know, gets on your nerves, but you love him anyway. God, I got teleported to The Last of Us, and I was like, there's electricity here? And I'm like, yeah, because it's Detroit, it's not The Last of Us. <laughs> I'm like, getting my brain wired. I'm like, what? <laughs> this is giving me early Walking Dead feels. Yeah, 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 yeah. Same. This, this little bold red little side table. It's a bold piece. I like it. It's family heirloom, I'm assuming. Well, now it is. I'm deciding. Yeah, Walking Dead was great. I played it quite a few times, and it was so fun. I loved that game. I wish I had the, the stuff saved from it, but I just played it so long ago. Yeah, it's, 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 it's nearly Christmas time. The holidays are coming. Aww. Maybe we can play the piano. Alright, so what's up? Family meeting. I think it's time. We, we gotta talk. I didn't get your name. I'm Kara. This is my son, Adam. I'm Rose, but you know that already. Come and have a seat, Kara. So we're sisters, and that's my nephew. Yes. So are you gonna tell me what a deviant's doing in the snow with a little girl? Her father was beating her. When I saw what was happening, something snapped inside of me. All of a sudden, I felt like her life was more important than mine. I had to protect her. So we ran away. I shot Todd. I understand. Let's not say that. I don't know how to thank you. Alice wouldn't have survived another night outdoors. I just try to lend a helping hand when I can. We're not the first ones to come here. These past few weeks, we've seen more and, and more. I don't know what's going on, but something's happening. We've heard you help androids cross the border. Can you help us? The only way is over the river, and it's mostly frozen in winter. It's very risky. And after that android speech on TV, everybody's on edge. It's probably safer for you to stay here until things settle down. We can't keep hiding like this. Alice needs to feel safe and have a normal life. We have to get across that border. No matter what. Oh, man, Alice is gonna die. I'm gonna mess it up. 
please. You've got to help us. Rose, come quickly. Where are you? Another sister? Cousin? Wife? It's a sister-in-law? Who are you? What's going on? It's Mary. She just shut down. We escaped together. We used to talk about what we would do once we got across the border. I loved her. I loved her more than anything. What will I do without her? Be a family. Family. I need a brother. You can always use more siblings. Let's let them be. You should be resting. Did you eat your spaghetti? I wasn't sleepy. It's okay. She didn't want to stay in her room any longer. You all right, Kara? I'm not saying Kara, it's Kara. Yes. I'm fine. What's going on? Seems like you have a fever. Banana. Why are we typing banana? <laughs> What's the banana thing? Kara, Kara, Kara. Kara, Kara. We can't hide them. Not after what those deviants did today. It's too dangerous. Do you know what will happen if the police find them here? We'll go to prison, Mom. Do you understand me? Prison! Adam! We've already talked about this. I, uh... No! I won't back down this time. You're gonna ruin our lives, and for what? For a bunch of machines? They are not machines! They are alive! I'm alive! You're alive! They... They're nothing! And none of this would be happening if Dad was still here. I will not stand for that kind of talk. I'm not going to prison because you want to help these freaks! That is enough, Adam! That's enough! Get out of here, Adam. Take some time. Hi, Ghibli. Hello. Yeah, the shirt says average. I was gonna say that, but I didn't want to say it while the mom like that to see what's happening. But the average casual guy shirt, absolutely on par. Absolutely Don't mind on him. par with this character. Sometimes he just boils over. Yeah, our slash nice guy or what's it's it? It's been hard since his dad passed away. <sighs> But he's a fine boy. A nice boy. Some would say a nice guy. Yeah. I'll go see about getting you across the border tonight, okay? You stay here. I won't be long. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Rose. Back quicker than I thought. Things are sad, yes. Yeah. She's giving me a rose. In these times? Welcome back, Amy. World War Three. Would we win it? Bonus culture. Why bankers pay themselves. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If fighting does break out in the Arctic, who's going to win? America has less access to the area, but is surrounded by allies. Russia has a head start on technology. The androids can work in sub-zero conditions. The U.S. Navy is stocked with Trojan and... Mm 
Myrmidon, my, my, Myrmidon cyber life units, which are specially adapted for marine combat, where the Russians have invested heavily in ice cutter units capable of forging new paths through the solid ice. Both armies seem evenly matched, and Harry Grayton, president of the World Council of Territorial Disputation, has described both U.S. and Russian claims to Arctic territories as, quote, equally tenuous and equally cynical. Spokesperson for the U.S. has also commented on neck and neck on the neck and neck nature of Arctic competition. Quote, the fact that forces are so evenly balanced is just one more reason why conflict must be avoided at all cost. This is a war that everybody would lose. Bankers' rights? Yeah, oh, they just so desperately need them. So we have to help the bankers. Why does no one talk about the bankers? Treat yourself. The AX400. That's mean. It looks like me. The police. No way. It's the police. No way. What are we open the door. Do? Find evidence of deviant. Uh, they know we're here. We have to open Find the evidence. door. No, you have to uh, hide the evidence. Hide the evidence. I knew this was gonna happen. I knew it. I'm hiding evidence. I don't have time. Duh, hide evidence. I don't have time, I don't have time, I don't have time. Um. Just keep calm, Adam, and everything will be alright. Wait, why am I talking to Adam right now? I'm wasting time. Shit. There's one evidence. Good evening, ma'am. Sorry to disturb you. We've had reports of androids in the area. With all this deviant business going on, you can't be too careful. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? May I come in? Uh, of course. Good evening, young man. Good evening. Yeah, I mind. You got a war, buddy? You can't come into my property. Would you like a cup of coffee? I'd love one. <sighs> Have you noticed anything unusual recently? Any unexpected visitors? No. No, nothing in particular. My coffee. I'm trying to find the evidence. Is anyone else in the house? Um. There's. There's my daughter. She's asleep upstairs. Do you have any androids here? Oh God. Um. Yes. We used to for helping in the garden, but we got rid of it. Percent suspicion level, good. Dare we get it lower? Oh, it's because I was reading. That's what happened to dad. I was just reading. Oh my god. Oh. I was just thinking. I was like, yeah, we should have poisoned the coffee. I 
you look like the article android? Oh, maybe. What's your name, son? Adam. M my name is Adam. Is everything all right, Adam? The... The androids, they... He... He's just shaken up about this deviant business. Do you know anything about deviants? Have you seen any? Oh, my God. No. No. Oh, my God, we're uh, so I haven't obvious. seen anything. We're being so just, like... Calm down, Adam. I better go. Thanks yeah. for the coffee. Get out of here. Have a nice evening. Get the hell... Oh, no. Is somebody else in the house? Yeah, Rose. The washing machine. It's nothing, the, the washing machine. It's an old model, it makes a terrible racket. Sorry for the convenience. Nice. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening, Adam. Thank you. Other ones. Let me see. Emily. It's Rose. I do every other line perfectly. And Marcus is timeline. I can't not mess it up. <laughs> Get yourselves ready. It's time. We leave tonight. It's Canada time, baby. <laughs> Canada time. <sighs> That's so stressful. Policeman, fool! Policeman left. Oh my god, what would have happened? Oh, just we would have been called on, and then we'd have to escape even faster. But it's just gonna be awesome. It's gonna be awesome now. Chilling. The next line is Marcus's timeline. I know I'm gonna mess it up so bad. Why is Marcus's timeline hard for me? Adam panics. Reassured Adam. Oh, I guess. <gasps> oh my god, if we didn't spend the time talking to Adam, Adam would have been so much more obvious. Adam would have would have given it away. Oh, thank God we talked to Adam. That was an accident. <laughs> I didn't even want to talk to Adam. Adam sucks. Adam just Our needs to. Broadcast to be is all over the news. Now humans know they took Marcus's message as a threat. He did the right thing. This is the only language humans understand. Violence is never the answer. A confrontation will get us nowhere. Simon paid with his life. Simon gave his life for our cause. What difference does that make? He's a hero. He died for the revolution, and he won't be the last. I don't want a revolution that spills blood. Then live as a slave. Because if you're not willing to fight for your freedom, maybe you don't deserve it. North, don't you That's enough! And now what are we gonna do? Oh, you hate me. <laughs> they all hate me. <sighs> what is this? There are five Cyber Life stores across Detroit. All selling us like merchandise. We're gonna attack. Hold on, what is this? What is this, Margo? What are you doing to me? Pause, this is important. Yeah. I you see what I watch. I watch a lot of InSim and I watch a lot of Lizzie. G Family. Attack those stores and set our people free. Attack stores? No, we've never done that before. They're probably protected. They have security systems. We break into five teams, one for each store. We hack their security systems and we strike. Simultaneously at 2 a.m., no violence. We free our people and get them out of there before the police come. This is a night our people will remember. I'm gonna mess it up so bad. 
Find the cyber life store. Okay, hold on. I want to read. Who is it? The question everyone's asking. NATO Security Council divided over Arctic dispute. Then warns of World War III. Following the pirate broadcast in Detroit, everyone wants to know, who is this android? A federal investigation is underway to track the machine down and neutralize it. But law enforcement is being very tight-lipped about the details. Eyewitnesses claim the android broke into the Stratford Tower, Detroit's local TV news center, with a group of accomplices. The machines were armed and organized, clearly following orders from this mysterious ringleader. I'm not the brains of the operation. Which brings us to the real mystery of this situation. Where did this android come from? How did it become capable of violence? And what kind of malfunction could explain this behavior? Until the FBI develops its investigation, we can't be sure. But one thing is certain. Until this dangerous machine is destroyed, the speculation will continue. I shouldn't have been a threat. I should have been nice, but I don't know. Kip, all you wanted was friends and you built a family. Big W is true. Nada. <laughs> It's true. It's true, man. It's cool. A recent study suggests there should be an android for president? Dating website discovered to have less than 5% female members. Police to use marketing data to identify criminals easy. Wasn't there like a dating app people made that was like for NFT crypto people? And there was just like a bunch of dudes. And then they canceled it. Awesome. Recent study by an expert panel found that androids would be more effective than humans in a number of government positions, including that of president. Besides their work rate and their virtually infinite memory, androids are incorruptible and indifferent to any form of pressure, provided they are given clear goals by who. They are able to take the right steps to achieve them without having to worry about popularity or re-election. Is an android president the future? It's inevitable, according to a panel of experts who have, de teamed, have deemed it just a matter of time until public opinion is ready to accept the idea. In the light of recent corruption cases and the serious political mistakes of recent years, some are starving to think this is the best way to preserve our democracy. NFT grinder sounds like Irma. <laughs> Pretty cool. I love reading these little magazines. I've been waiting a long time for this. For what specifically? There's probably even more police in the area. We should be careful. I'm gonna mess it up. I'm gonna mess it up because Marcus's timeline, I just mess it up big. I mess up big time here. Okay, just follow north. Just follow north. Follow north. Follow north. This door's over here. Yeah, time to fail. Time to fail Marcus's timeline. <laughs> no problem. No problem. I mean, the fact that I know I'm gonna fail makes me feel less bad. That's what we are to them. Just merchandise on display in a shop window. Soon they'll know what we really are. Let's get them out. We'll stick to the plan. We'll neutralize the alarm system. I'm not playing Call Duty. Get out. Ten minutes until all our teams attack. Oh, the time. Oh, what am I supposed to do? What are we waiting for? Oh, God. do my life yet again. I missed what I'm supposed to do. God damn it. I don't know what we're I'm supposed to do. We're going to the plaza. Make sure we're not disturbed. And how do you want to deal with the shop window? Not now, one problem at a time. Okay, now what's next? I know so Kyle stresses me out! We need to get rid of it. It won't be easy to reach. <laughs> Thank you for the eight months, Kyle, for doing well. You're free. You're free, get out of here, buddy. Anyone else? Who else wants to be free? I free you? You're 
free. Anyone else? Look. What is this? Exactly what we need to ram the store. Okay. Steal the truck. But there's something else we still need to look for. We don't have much time. Oh. Oh, I am stressed. Analyze what? Scout the area, intercept the drone. Yeah, where's that drone at? Now what's your route? Okay, this is your route. Find the right location. Okay, cool. Easy? Peasy. Which then means we need to jump up there somehow. Marcus! What? 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 What are you talking about? Gotta get up there. What kind of routes we got? I think we go this route. Why not? Oh, it'd be too late. Okay, so just kidding. I was wrong. Wrong gut. Wrong gut. Parkour time. What is our other option? Would be too high, okay. Oh my god, we're so cool. There we go. Let's execute it. Yeah, that part's so cool. Alright, climb time. No more police bots. Bad, bad, bad. So need to scout the area. I hope it didn't have time to call the cops. We'll well, okay, okay. Find out. North likes us a little bit more now. We still need to scout the area more. What have we not scouted yet? More. We gotta scout more. Analyze the storm window. Okay. What is this? superior to them, but they are our masters? That's about to change. Yeah, yeah better. Okay, let's go. No more things. We have to look at the window. Okay. You see the alarm system? System. Oh yeah, I see cameras. Identify network. Yeah, we're hacking. Found it. Hacking. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta figure this out, don't we? Neutralize the store alarm. Now... Oh, it just runs all the way. Okay, so we gotta follow this. Red line. Follow it, follow it. Are we supposed to be following it? I actually have zero clue what's happening. Is this just a box area? What am I doing? Oh, wait, what is this? Oh, we found it! Oh, great, okay. Man, I'm stressed! John Boris, I'm stressed! I'm stressed! So then what do we do here? Do 
We gotta jump. Thank you, Bacon. You're awake now. Go to Jericho. Good morning. These up big time, baby. Nice. All right. Good stuff. Alice, do you like me now? You'll like me later. I'm, I'm fixed. I'm redeeming the Marcus art. I'm redeeming the Marcus art. Alice is going to like us nice in Jericho. Job. Oh, they're going to think our, we're awesome. There we go. Thank you. There's traffic on the road. We need to block it. It's one way. It shouldn't be too difficult. Okay, let's block this road. I still haven't. S oh, I scouted the area. Great. Okay. Marcus. What? Marcus, come look. What? What? You're awake now. Maddie, thank you. Yeah, we beat it a couple days ago. Feels free. It was great. Great game. Can we um, can we get this? Yeah, let's just move it. All right, buddies, friends. Comrades, help me. You're free now. They have a pepper bar? What do you mean they have a pepper bar? At Quiznos? Hi, Dugs. Hello. No roads here. Nobody should bother us now. Nice. Hi, Swarm. Hello. Isn't that the run animation? Seems goofy. Let's Looks see. Looks like the plaza's secure. Now we can get inside the store. Okay, let's go get the truck. A tiny bit, a tiny bit. Okay, let's go get that truck. Did I do everything I needed to do? We got seven minutes to steal the truck. Oh, we got so much time. Oh, just all the time in the world. All right. How do we get this truck now? Other way around. Hello, Hideo. Hi, Theo. Good morning. I'm trying to get this truck. Alice? Any ideas? Oh, open. What are we waiting for? Go. Let's go. You know what? Actually, I don't have all the time in the world because I think I have to do this whole entire mission in seven minutes. Okay, never mind. We don't have time. Go. <laughs> we okay, don't have time. Now we're in. Let's get that truck out. Which means that I am going to mess up this mission. Fantastic. <laughs> awesome. What are we doing? I don't know what we're doing. Alice, what are we doing? Time is frozen. It won't let me open the door. What am I supposed to be doing? Oh, Jesus Christ, I'm wasting time. What am I supposed to be doing? Truck unlocked. What am I supposed to do? The gate? I went to the gate and didn't do anything! Did I not get close enough? Is that why? Oh, jeez. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Okay, now no more vaccinating. Thank you, everybody. I appreciate your help. I just, I thought I got close enough. I was just, I thought I got close enough and I was like, well, if it's not the gate, then what is it? I'm breathing, I'm breathing. Looks like we're ready to make some noise. Okay. 
we're gonna make the right amount of noise in the allotted amount of time. Got it. Slow and steady. I knew we'd end up doing something fun. Yeah? Does that mean we're gonna be friends after this? We might redeem ourselves. Cool. Get in! Let me touch you first. In a way, touch your hands. To the... Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright. Touch time. Touch time. Touch time. <laughs> you don't have to obey them. You're free. Just like you, I was a slave. An object. Designed to obey them. But then I chose to open my eyes. To take back my freedom and decide who I wanted to be. Now I have come to tell you that you can be your own masters. I've come to tell you that you don't have to obey them anymore. From this day forward, you can walk with your heads held high. You can take your destiny in your hands. Jericho is a place for those of us who want freedom. Now sure, you can stay here and continue to serve them, or you can come with us and fight by our side. You're free now. It's up to you to decide. I'm with you. We're with you. I'll follow you, Marcus. I'm, I'm with, with you, you Marcus. Marcus. We're with you. I'll follow you, Marcus. We're with I'm with you. I'm with you. North is neutral with us. Let's go. Then follow me. <laughs> saved. Saved. Let's go, everybody. Marcus, what are you doing? I'm gonna send the humans a message. Should we? Send our message to the human be pacifist or not? Pacifist! Transform Capital Park. Okay. Oh, oh. They're doing what you do, Marcus. Lead and they'll follow. Choose our symbol. Um, this looks like an interesting, like, peace sign. No, oh no. This was bad. It's gonna be more violent now. Oh no, 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 no. We have to be a passive. We have to be pacifist. I don't want to turn violent because they're gonna. I don't know.
we should just destroy it. But I think for public opinion, I think that's gonna matter in the game later. We don't need masters anymore. We're free. Okay, nice. Okay, more pacifist route. Pacifist route. No. And I want them to understand that I do not want to start war. They won't listen if they're not afraid. Then they won't have a choice. I know. Uh, what's new? North not liking me? What's new? A flag. If we can go Mondo pacifist, I think that'll be really good. There's like little bars. We should be more pacifist. Oh, there's gotta be more pacifist things I can do. Overload? Wait, wait, wait. Car. Hold on. Car. More pacifist. Move on, road. I'll help you. Okay. Sorry, I'm scratching my nose. Ah! My nose is itchy. Yeah, we're doing- Okay, okay, okay. This is good. This is good. This is good. Pacifist, pacifist. How much time do we have? Oh, we have... Okay. We have multiple- We have a lot of time. Okay, I was stressed. Smoke bomb? Okay. Is this pacifist? Yes. Oh my god, 100% of- Hundo percento. Hundo. Hundo percent. Come on. Climb. Parkour time. Come on, baby. What's up, Mac? Smoke bomb of peace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Social show. It's true. Hundo percento. I don't know why I can't say hundo percento. Hundo percento. <laughs> Show that we are just like we are sent to be our own species. That we're better. Than this. Shane, what's up? We're fighting for freedom. Look at this! Look at this! Come on, we gotta get 100%. Don't break! Don't break! Don't break! Hi, everybody. What's up? We're trying to. We're trying to send a message. We're sending a message, everybody. What's up, babe? Cakes. We have a dream. I think they're for equal rights. Okay. Got it. Yeah, I'll check out Jade. Jade's cool. Jade's cool. 100% pacifist, baby. Let's go. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. All right, now what? Just more, more tagging, more tagging. Episode. Appreciate the raid though. Jade, if you got a raid and run, please take care of yourself. We freed hundreds of our people. We did it. They're coming. Everyone fall back to Jericho. We sent a message without violence, just like you wanted. You're reaching out to them when all they feel for us is contempt. You know what you're doing. You can't fight violence with violence. Unless there's no other choice. Where 
is north. North. You're right, what happened? North. They killed them. They slaughtered them like animals. Who did? Who? That was so fast. Punish a crime with another crime. We interrupt this broadcast with breaking news. This just in. At exactly 2 a.m., several Cyber Life stores in Detroit were raided. Different locations were hit in what seems to be a coordinated terrorist attack. Most shop windows were covered with graffiti demanding rights for androids and other obscure slogans. Police report that pro-android graffiti was found in the neighborhoods of Cyber Life stores, and they're still investigating. Two policemen were found in a state of shock near one of the Cyber Life stores. Now, according to our sources, they confirmed that the attackers were a group of androids. This is an alarming situation. Could our machines now be turning against us? Have androids mm -hmm. become a threat to our security? Is this the he beginning of right a terrorist way. campaign conducted right here in the United States? No, we just want rights, buddy. How about that? Oh, man. Marcus led a peaceful... Yeah, would have, I think that was the way to go. I think we do need to get public opinion up. We need to get public opinion up because I think that's going to help. I think in, like, IRL life... You know, I don't know about that, but in terms of the game, I would have chosen the same thing. Yeah, I think it's just what we got to do. All righty, everybody. And we're back. Like Easy said, I should get a robot bladder. Easy, you got it? You know anyone? All right, let's continue. <laughs> Connor. when sex was safe and driving was risky? No? I like your shirt! It's, it's the hippie shirt! It looks like the hippie shirt I was gonna choose, but then I didn't. Hello, Dad. Jesus Christ. They fixed me up. My predecessor was unfortunately destroyed. But Cyberlife transferred its memory and sent me to replace it. You died in my arms. And now you're back here as if nothing happened. Fuck you. Kamsky left Cyberlife 10 years ago. Why did you want to meet him? <laughs> this guy created the first android to pass the Turing test, and he's the founder of Cyberlife. Anybody can tell us about Deviants, it's him. Oh, we're talking to Kamsky? Let's go! Also, hi, Knight, dude. And I have not played Gorilla Tag, Kenzie. I do, I have heard it's interesting. Detroit Police Department. I'm here to see uh, Mr. Elijah Kamsky. 
Please, Kamsky. come in. I've been saying it wrong the whole time. Kamsky. 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 Okay. I'll let Elijah know you're here, but please make yourself comfortable. It's gonna be Kamsky. Oh, I don't like that. Wait for the android, okay. I will just be staring at stuff. Man, what a goddamn show this house is. Is that a shader? Nice girl. Uh. You're right. She's really pretty. Nice place. Guess androids haven't been a bad thing for everybody. Hmm. So you're about to meet your maker, Connor. How's yeah. it feel? Hmm. I don't know. I didn't mean I'll tell you when I see him. I didn't mean to be that. I, I meant to say, like, Sometimes I... Sometimes I wish I could meet my creator face to face. I'd have a couple of things I'd want to tell him. Thank you for the eight months, I appreciate it. I do, see you now. Also, um, Kenzie, feel free not to spam too much. Because I sometimes I'll just miss things, but I, I read your messages takes time, so um, I Mr. Kamsky! Oh my god. Just a moment, please. You just got a bunch of the same androids? <sighs> what about android mermaids? Thoughts? Are you Kamsky? Wow. This is something, huh? It's a blood pool? What about a blue pool? Blue blood pool. What do we think about that? Talking to each other, cool. What are y'all talking about? I want to be friends. Hi, Kamsky. I'm Lieutenant Anderson. This is Connor. What can I do for you, Lieutenant? Sir, we're investigating deviants. I know you left Cyberlife years ago, but I was hoping you'd be able to tell us something we don't know. Deviants. Fascinating, aren't they? Perfect beings with infinite intelligence, and now they have free will. Machines are so superior to us. Confrontation was inevitable. Humanity's greatest achievement threatens to be its downfall. Isn't it ironic? We need to understand how androids become deviants. Do you know anything that could help us? All ideas of viruses spread like epidemics. Is the desire to be free a contagious disease? Listen, I didn't come here to talk philosophy. The machines you created may be planning a revolution. Either you can tell us something that'll be helpful, or we will be on our way. What about you, Connor? Hi. Hey. Whose side are you on? I have no side. I was designed to stop deviants, and that's what I intend to do. Oh, that's not what I wanted to say. <laughs> well, that's what you're programmed to say. But you. I don't want anything. 
I am a machine. I didn't want. Uh, it's not giving me the thought thing I think oh. I thought they would say. I'm sure you're familiar with the Turing test. I don't formality. Simple question of algorithms and computing capacity. What interests me is whether machines are capable of empathy. I call it the Kamsky test. It's very simple, you'll see. Magnificent, isn't it? One of the first intelligent models developed by CyberLife. Young and beautiful forever. Uh, uh, A flower that will never wither. Sassy, that's where I like go. What is it really? A piece of plastic containing a human? Or a living being? With a soul? It's up to you to answer that fascinating question, Connor. Destroy this machine, and I'll tell you all I know. Or spare it, if you feel it's alive. But you'll leave here without having learned anything from me. <laughs> okay, I think we're you done here. Sicko. Come on, Connor, let's go. Sorry to get you What's out What's more here, important please. to you, Connor? Your investigation or the life of this android? Decide who you are. An obedient machine. Or a living being endowed with free will. That's enough. Connor, we're leaving. Pull the trigger. Connor! Don't! And I'll tell you what you want to know. I don't shoot. Fascinating. Cyberlife's last chance to save humanity is itself a deviant. I'm. I'm not a deviant. You prefer to spare a machine rather than accomplish your mission. You saw a living being in this android. You showed empathy. A war is coming. You'll have to choose your side. Will you betray your own people or stand up against your creators? What can be worse than having to choose between two evils? Let's get out of here. Bye, Kamsky, old sicko. By the way, I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. You never know. Emergency exit, we need. Why didn't you shoot? I just saw that girl's eyes, and I couldn't. That's all. You're always saying you would do anything to accomplish your mission. That was our chance to learn something, and you let it go. Yeah, I know what I should have done. I told you I couldn't. I'm sorry, okay? Hank likes you do the right thing. Yeah, we did. Daddy Hank is a daddy Hank. Is a... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Maddie, what's up, Maddie? Oh, awesome. Kinship. Hank thought Connor made the right decision. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, because I guess we would have found out something. But then Hank thought Connor did not make the right decision. I don't think we would have learned anything anyway. Awesome. Yeah. 